Met my baby mama before I met my mama, baby daddy. I was raised on survival, not no family, not no motivation, just evil looks and some cold touches. I'm a lost soul who heart froze. I don't love nothing. Well, well, except my kids, but if they grow up and they live and they say, all right, check this. Wait a minute, hold on. What's up, my people? First off, hey, look, I woke up in a great mood just now, and it gave me a little inspiration. Um, one of the biggest female rappers in the world just selected a song I wrote, Praise Bird, Paperwork Coming Soon. That's a whole nother flex coming to y'all. Hold on one second. Oh, has this thing on? Radio, can they hear me? Speaking loud. Can you hear me? Right? Yep, yep, I yeah, can hear you. All right, yeah, y'all heard it right. One of the biggest female rappers in the world just selected a song I wrote. Oh, it's really finna get thunderous. So, oh, besides that, before we go there too, before we go there too, hey, any of you bloggers, I'm challenging y'all. Let's let's start here first, right? So y'all not gonna play and twist it, right? Look, let's let's start here, right? Any of you bloggers, I'm challenging you. Pussies. Do y'all hear me? Let's 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 get this straight, blogger niggas. I'm challenging you punks. Bloggers, check this out. Check this out, bloggers. I'm challenging it, right? Oh yeah, first off, for y'all that's coming in, one of my records was just selected by one of the biggest female rappers in the world. Y'all do know that's a extreme pay increase, and I'm gonna get very thunderous. Like very thunderous. Besides that, though, bloggers, listen. If you if you want to play in twist theories, right? I'm finna do shit to you. I'm I'm calling that out off the jump. I'm telling y'all off the jump. I'm gonna do things to you. Like I'm gonna show y'all and play with y'all in ways that y'all ain't gonna want to get played with. Now, I will joke y'all into oblivion, people and make you feel less than a human. Won't I, angry fan? Hmm? Won't I, angry fan? Hmm? Hey, angry fan, you're not armed to play with me, boss. Angry fan, you're not armed enough to play like that. Armed. Listen, listen, let me let me say something to you, vlogger guys, right quick. All right. Keep it cute, man. Like, you know, try to be. Because most of you are ugly. Mm hmm The opposite of handsome. Ugly. Most of you bloggers that's want to play have been called ugly for the majority of your life, haven't you? Mm-hmm. See, I told y'all I understand how the brain works. I studied it, right? Most of you bloggers, not all of you, some of you guys are cool, right? Most of you bloggers are ugly. You know, when you hear that, it's probably traumatizing, ain't you? Because guess what? When you get the camera, when you get on the camera, right? The camera makes you feel handsome, doesn't it? It shouldn't. Angry fan, your camera's still in 720, and we got 4K out here. But I understand in your situation, angry fan, the reason why you want to keep your camera fuzzy, because if you put that bitch in HD, you're going to look hideous, aren't you? Mm -hmm. You know how, like, sometimes a girl asks for, like, you be like, let me get a picture, and they'll send you a little blurry motherfucker, because they don't want you to fully see the features. Angry fan, why is your camera still in 720? Hmm? Where's your camera? Hmm? Why, why is your camera still set on 720 and 680p, motherfucker? It's 4K out here, sir. We're, we're at level 4K, angry fan. Mm hmm See, look, I want to say something to y'all bloggers, right? This is the truth, right? Y'all see what happens. You see the gas. You see those things, right? But you let your feelings out, right? Because y'all can't fuck with me or nothing. And I get it, though, because most of y'all were poor, right? Your life is predicated on other niggas making money. Like, you have no lifeline, right? Like, this is when, when we start playing for real. Because 
Like, you know how much most of y'all have to move y'all mouth on camera? You know you move your fucking lips for money? That's like a prostitute. You do understand it, right? See, we think for money, right? You know how many mouth times you have to move your mouth and say a nigga's name to feed your fucking families? Hmm? You have to lick your lips. And you have to be dry mouthed and constantly talk about other people with dicks. That's how you make your money. When, when fortunately, I have been blessed that I can think and make half of what y'all make on YouTube in five, four or five months. Now, based on hot topics, like hot topics, like if I'm tripping with y'all, your money going to go up. And I am going to be tripping with y'all. Like I told y'all, this was trip week. Last Wednesday, I told y'all, before we went to Miami, I said, the, the week after, I'm about to be, I had this mapped out. I've had this mapped out. Okay, so which one of y'all want to go first? Hmm? Who wants to sacrifice their arm? Hmm? Who wants to go first? Who? Now, we're going to, hey, listen, everybody on the set, get your, start your YouTube channel today. You might want to get you some of this. You might want to, everybody on the set, start your YouTube channel today. You're going to want to get these coming. For sure. So uh, attention bloggers. I I said last week before we went to Miami that, that the following week will be drastic. I did say that. It's documented. I did not. I, I, I wrote this out and I said the following week will be worse than what you expect. Because I've been targeting y'all. I'm sorry. I have. Like, I got bored two weeks ago, right? And I started targeting y'all. I started like zoning out on who y'all was. Because, like, I didn't, I didn't like the fact, like, last week, everybody that's coming in, right? Last week, I informed the people. Last Wednesday, I said, the week coming up, starting Monday. Okay, am I lying? Ray, do you still there? Am I lying or not? Yeah, I'm here now. You ain't lying. Okay, all right. I, last Wednesday, I said, hey, man, the following week, guys, I'm going to get very graphic with y'all. I said, starting Monday. I told y'all that too. I said starting Monday. So bloggers, I have most of you like really mapped out. Y'all are really dorks with little fetishes and little secrets. I'm about to really step on y'all for real. Like I found, see, the thing is, the inspiration from the Kendrick and Drake thing is making me hunt the filth. Now who want to go first? Which one of you motherfuckers want to raise y'all bitch ass arms? And, well, angry fan, don't rush to that. You don't have much to spare. Not you. We'll put you on the handicap list. I said, raise your fucking hand. Anybody that has two, because you have to be able to still do it. All right, angry fan, we're going to make an exception for you. Trust me, you're VIP here. You are. You're VIP. You, my friend, we're going to roll you right in this bitch. You hear me? Nigga. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, I, but I did tell y'all this last Wednesday. It's documented. Mm -hmm. Last Wednesday, I, I informed the people that this was going to happen, right? Because I noticed something two weeks ago, right? I said, hey, you know what these bloggers have? They have a look like over the over the weak people. Y'all have too much power over the weak. No power over the strong. So I said this last week that we're going to break that chain. Okay. Now, which one of you bloggers is feeling bold enough to start? Now, I know most of y'all is going to think from the, the monetary side, right? And say, hey, verb tripping with us. I get to make some money this month. You should probably think slowly. I planned this out, niggas. What did, what did Denzel say in training day? What did I tell y'all I was? Belonzo. I said, starting next Monday, I will be cruising the streets and causing problems. I said this last Wednesday. Right? Like, y'all have to understand something. Like, Gemini people like myself, like, we're calculated as fuck. Like, let me give y'all a couple famous Geminis, okay? Uh, me, Kendrick Lamar, Tupac, Donald Trump, Kanye West. That's the kind of shit you matching up with. Okay? Like, all those wrapped in one nigga. You hear me? Like, that's what we all are. Dave East is one of us, too. Right? Um, Kodak Black is one of us. Like, that's our, that's my team. Okay? Those are my friends. Like, I understand them greatly, right? If you don't understand that being... You probably shouldn't. Now, I planned out this hit last week. Last Wednesday, I, I, I did communicate to the people. And I said, I'm going to be tripping with the bloggers. I, I didn't say bloggers. I said the week after I get back home, I said Monday, it will be new rules getting enforced. Bloggers, if I catch you saying anything negative about rappers, 
I'm going to start revealing little things. Matter of fact, we're going to just start it today. Okay? Because y'all are freaks. And y'all have little fetishes. Because I was looking at y'all one day. Like, not all y'all, though. I'm going to say 10% of y'all, I think, is safe. For real. 10% of y'all, I think, is like humans. Like, in, in the real in the real world, 10% of y'all. Okay, like, for instance, right? I know Henny Man is a human in, in real life. Because I met him before he picked the camera up. You feel me? So like I and, and I've been to work like see this like the thing is with a person like Henny, right? I'm gonna tell y'all for 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 me, from my view of it, you can't really do too much to them. Because I met him beforehand, right? I met him before he picked the camera up on that. End. I met him on the rapper side, right? And I've been to his his neighborhoods. That's the only thing. See, the thing is with you bloggers. Most of y'all, you can't go to where you're from. Because, see, I, I've been targeting y'all for like a month, for real. It's just that I'm so calculated, I don't show it. Y'all, you punks have too much power and don't nobody really know who y'all are. But I know. I've learned. I told y'all last Wednesday I'm tripping starting Monday with y'all, right? Now, who want to go first? Angry fan, my energy is really looking at you, though, to sacrifice you, ugly. You little shocked anteater face bitch. You, right? Now, you didn't, your your thought process is so fucked up, nigga. You, oh man, you got way too, you, how do you, like I'm looking at you and who you are, and I'm like, how do you have power and you got one on? Like, there's no, there's nothing that's, that's, there's nothing on this planet that isn't a loss for a limb with power. You're missing something, right? Hey, angry fan, guess what you can't do, huh? You can never grab a bitch on both sides of her ass and, and hump her, nigga. You can never do that, huh? Not at all. Hey, angry fan, just dream about it, nigga. Huh? Just think about it. Think about taking, like, think about the time in your life when you could take both arms and grab a bitch on both sides of her hips and hump her from the back. You will never do that again in your motherfucking life, nigga. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I told y'all. It's up, right? Angry fan, you'll never be able to cross your arms. See, angry fan, when you be fucking them hoes, sometimes your niggas get niggas get slick. The niggas in, in, in the church, they know, right? The niggas are covered across their arms. Like, yeah, nigga, really start flexing, right? You'll never do that again in your life. How that make you feel? How does that make you feel, nigga? You'll never be able to grip a bitch around her waist. Huh? And, and and you'll never do it again in your fucking life. We'll get to you in a minute. It's a couple more that I've highlighted, but I'm saving those for big bangs for the day. Oh, yeah, we're going to just start with him. You niggas seem to have too much, like, like, I started watching y'all, and I was like, hey, man, these niggas is really dorks with cameras. Y'all are dorks with cameras. Their whole life is predicated off everybody else's. That means you're nothing. That means you're nothing in the real world. So if you're nothing in the real world, why don't we pull these niggas to the front? And I have no mercy. Guys, listen. This is me, Angry Fan. I'm just, right now, I ain't even started on you yet. Trust me, right? Hey, Angry Fan, I have both of my arms raised right now. You can't do this either. Hey, Angry Fan, guess what? You'll never be able to hoop. And they say, hey, Angry Fan, get your hands up. Niggas will never tell you that again in your mouth. Man, get, get your hands up, nigga. You'll never be able to do that again. You can't catch a motherfucking football over your head again, nigga. We're going to get to you in a second, though. Hello. Hello, everybody. I'm A-Verb, and I'm the biggest, most dangerous bird here. Mm-hmm. Me. Y'all can try to jump me. Y'all could, you niggas could make things rough, break rules. I am the biggest, most dangerous bird in this sky. Like, and that will be forever, guys. Yeah, we're going to get to you. Angry fan, trust me. We're going to get to you in a minute, early. Like, I, I start breaking down y'all lives and hunting y'all. Like, really like dogs, for real. Like, any of y'all. Hey, listen. Any, oh, matter of fact, several of y'all getting attacked to it. Like, y'all think it's cool with me? Y'all not. It's not. I just pretend like it's cool. Because I can shapeshift, right? I can pretend like you cool. Smile, answer the phone, and talk to you, and up a pistol in the back of your motherfucking head. That's who I am, though. And I've also been telling y'all that for the longest, too. I said, starting Monday... I am tripping with y'all, man. Right? Because I'm like, you punks have a little too much juice here for some reason. It's like in this small little box, y'all have like people like listen to your like y'all are weirdos, man. Like you guys are weird you guys pick up cameras 
And that's how you become a person in a fig like in the real world. Like angry fan, like it was raining and you didn't have shoes on. And it, 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 you know, and a, it's like it, stop, bro. It's, no, you've already started though. We're gonna get you. I'm gonna get most of y'all. For real. Like it's gonna be some shocking things said because I found out who you are. I found out who you are. I found your fetishes. I talked to your friends from your past. I learned your little freaky secrets. I learned, I learned how you played with him back in the day. And then you got here and started acting fancy. I, I, I found it out, guys. Like, y'all lives, you're, y'all are like primary rappers, right? They have no power, guys. They have zero power. They sit in front of cameras. And that's how they make money, talking. So if rap stops tomorrow, what do y'all do? Because when y'all talk about, when most of y'all talk about regular things, it dies. Doesn't it? The real world doesn't accept you. The real world, the real world will never accept you. It's only a few of y'all that the real world will accept. I found out things about all y'all, man. Because I said, hey, not, not for y'all to understand something. I said this last week, though. Last Wednesday, I informed y'all. I said, it's a lot of things. Oh, it's rappers in this collage, too, though. It's only a few, though. Not not too many. Y'all rappers are too easy to do. Like, way too easy. But nobody tried the blogger. So I was sitting up being the biggest bird in the sky looking down, right? And I was like, I'm going to take the bloggers out soon. One by one. I'm going to make severe examples of you because I know your insecurities now. All of you. I hunted you niggas like prey. And you think because you talked to me on the phone, it kept you safe. That's the weakest part about humans. Y'all have no idea who I'm about to target. Like, you guys are weak. You're weak humans. No power. You want power, but you don't have any. You emulate power. You, everyone here emulate. When I went and found out who y'all was, man. Oh, my God. That's why, see, the thing is, we have more creepy bloggers than anything, right? And their creep activity just gets swept under the rug. If a rapper does a creep activity, he's done. The bloggers have the freakiest fetishes on this motherfucking planet. But they pick their camera up and keep talking to them. So then I started noticing what niggas keep talking to the bloggers. Y'all are punks, man. I know who did shit to y'all from y'all cities. I got interviews coming. I mapped you bitch niggas out. It's y'all. I mapped y'all out, man. I said this last week. And and, and y'all became too trusting of me, man. I will do anything to y'all. I, that's why I remain the biggest. That's why I'm always going to be the biggest bird in the sky here. Because none of y'all can touch me. No matter what you throw. No matter what stipulation, you you can't stop me because I am the biggest, most dangerous bird in this sky. I can make your day dark, and this is for anybody. I summons the other powers of great humans on this planet. They come here. You guys are nothing. And I'm stepping on y'all. Hey, listen, one of y'all has a guy named Eric from your city that has smacked the fuck out of you twice. Hmm? Twice. Nigga, lightning don't strike twice in the same spot. How, did, how is this man right here, this human can say he smacked the shit out of you two times in two different occasions. See, see, see rappers, oh, 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 hey, y'all, it's dark around this bitch. I told y'all, but I said this shit last week, didn't I, Ray Duke? Didn't I say this shit, man? I said, hey, listen, when I get back from Miami, starting Monday, I'm going to unleash a wrath upon y'all, bro. I said this. Didn't I? Is Ray Duke there? Still? Okay, know. even, okay, yep. oh, my bad. Look, I, I, I released this information to y'all last week. I said, when I get back from Miami starting Monday, problems is going to start. You niggas kept smiling. I watched y'all. You, one of y'all has been smacked the shit out of twice and you playing like it didn't happen. He smacked you twice on two different occasions, man. I'm just letting, that's just me putting one card on the table. 
that's just one one card on tape. Oh, and Swizzy, my brother Swizzy, I'm gonna um let you know which one of your friends was playing with you too this week. Don't worry about it. Oh, I told y'all I'm about to cause madness and problems beyond measure. I'm telling y'all, listen, bro, the most biggest, most dangerous bird in this sky, me. When I turned around and showed them hoes, I said, hey, should I do this here? Be afraid, niggas. Hey, look, this why I, look, can't a nigga here touch me. I'm him. There's nothing you can do. It hurts, but it's nothing you can do. But I know y'all secrets now. Like, we already have seen, like, this is a culture where, like, a person can do some perverted shit to a child and y'all still watching. That's the kind of sick humans that we have here, right? Oh, this week it gets dark. And one of y'all had y'all dick sucked by a man. Now, I don't even, y'all know I don't even, like, I'm not even shocked by this type of shit. One of y'all bought some hair from a trans man, bro. Like, when you hear this type of shit with y'all niggas, man, it's like, okay, you niggas is playing, man. I said this last fucking week, man. Last Wednesday, hey, y'all, for y'all just got here. A record I wrote was just selected by one of the biggest female rappers on this planet. Y'all think it's bad now. Say something I don't like. It'll be forever. We are playing ball now. Listen, listen, community. We finna play, play ball. I controlled y'all here. Here. We finna play ball now. Which one of the bloggers bought some head from a guy with a beard? Who did that? Huh? Huh? Am I lying, sir? I'm just throwing my cards on the table, letting y'all know how dark it's about to get. And no, you can't cop any deuces with me. No. Hey, listen, my safety, in this safety, there will only be about three bloggers that'll be safe, man. Period, man. Now, which three that is, I don't think y'all know. A lot of y'all dick pool, right? Jump from person to person. You think that you're a factor. I am finna do things to y'all that y'all can't handle, man. I played with y'all. I, I, I played on y'all, man. Y'all know how dirty I am, man. Right? I used you. I make you think that you cool with me. And I ain't cool with a motherfucking person like that. You only got about three people that's cool in this situation. Everyone else dies. Right? Dies. Angry fan cannot do a motherfucking jumping jack ever again in his life. We're going to get to hey, Angry Fan. I'm, I feel like I should get to you first for some reason, but you'll never be able to do a jumping jack again in your life, ugly, can you? You'll never hear the sound again. Clap, 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 jump, jump, clap, clap, motherfucker. Hey, Angry Fan, hey, Angry Fan, guess what song you can't participate again? Clap your hands, everybody, and everybody, clap your hands. That's when you leave the party. And to the people in the front, clap your hands. We're not talking Angry Fan. Clap your hands. Bars. This is my shit. Right, right. So look, let's, let's continue. Let's stay on the path, right? You niggas is... I told y'all last Wednesday, I said, I'm going to be tripping starting Monday. Man. I do everything I said I'm going to do. I do, man. I come, I, I, I do everything I said, man. The champ is, nigga, y'all can't fuck with me, nigga. I was just in Miami. The whole room against the bullshit. They're quoting me. They're not quoting something. Y'all can jump and dick pool in the room all you want. No mistakes again. Remy complained about the crowd all night, how bad it was. You punks. We're going to get to it. Clap. 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 Hey, guess what else? Hey, angry fan, guess what song you probably hate now? Know your clap. You hear that? Know your clap. Don't participate, angry fan. Just rock and bend your fucking knees, ugly. You little shock anteater face. Just, just stand there and do that. Just stand there and do that, nigga. 
bum 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 do do bum 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 nigga you can't even participate in your favorite jams nigga you what's up problem no it's not the biggest most dangerous bird in this motherfucking sky is i nigga uh-huh we're gonna get you we're gonna get there in a minute don't worry about it so i just also just told y'all one of these niggas bought some head tell you what let's let's start a raffle let's start let's play a game right i think i want to have a contest today live on on youtube i think I think I want to have a contest. If you if you call which one of them niggas that bought the head, I think it should be a cash prize. I think it should be a cash prize today. I think, you know, I think it should be a cash prize on the human that can tell me the blogger that got his dick blown and bought some head from a nigga. Cash prize. I'm feeling real generous. See, see Swamp, with your back ends, you can't really do that type of shit, right? You can't, right? Okay, here I can. I'm feeling real motherfucking generous. I'm feeling real, and it's only a few to pick from. The first one that calls in, I think I'm going to do it. I'm going to set that up today. Let's get some artwork. Let's light this bitch back up, right? Let's really step on some shit. I think the fans need some money. You know, hey, rappers, I think y'all should participate too because these niggas done play a lot, right? And nigga bought some head, man. He didn't mack no nigga and get no head on no J2 shit. He This nigga bought some. He skipped the line. Nigga, when a nigga... He paid VIP for some head, man. Come on, man. When a nigga skipped the line, he is imperative. I need that. Like for me, when I go to clubs, it's imperative I skip this line, man. It's it, God damn it, it gotta happen. That means I'm willing to pay for that. Get me there. If a nigga bought some head from a nigga and walking around talking about rap, and you ain't told us you bought some head, man, yeah, we're gonna, we gonna set the artwork up today. We're going to make it a party. I think I'm going to give everybody the opportunity to make them a check today. Because it won't be hard. We sacrificing everybody to the lambs, man. We sacrificing y'all today. Like, I'm really tripping. I told y'all last Wednesday, man. I said, I'm tripping. I said, starting Monday. The problem is, niggas don't take heed. Like, when I say shit to y'all, and I be like, hey, you probably shouldn't trust me too much, man. Because it's like, I'll do anything. Like, for real. Like, I'm a type of nigga. I'll let you play with me and joke. And then the whole time, I'm just like lining your ass up for real. Cause I'll, I'll laugh and joke with you. And then I'll just line you the fuck up. Like for real, behind your back. I'm really like, I'm giving y'all my flaw. It's a flaw. Help me. Help me. Help me. Like if I make money with you, you kind of, you kind of safe a little bit. Cause money keeps me calm. Right. But I have, I have flaws. Y'all help me. Pray for me. Help me. I have little issues and I, I just don't forgive. I'm sorry. But yeah, somebody bought some head from a nigga, went and purchased a pack. Like, let me get a look. Hey, how much you want for that? Nigga, how much you want for it? What? Oh man, and it's a couple rappers too. Like you low level rappers. Oh man, y'all will never get broke fucking with me. Hey, look, I, I, I'm telling y'all the truth though, right? Y'all don't really understand branding. Oh, yeah, for y'all that just got here, one of the biggest, pay attention to what I said. Y'all don't listen. One of the biggest female rappers on this planet selected a record I wrote. Wrote with my pen and my thoughts. Yeah. It's highly possible, too, if you think about it. Mm -hmm. Highly probable, if you think about it. Just think about it for a second. Highly probable if y'all thought it was bad now nigga i'm gonna take from y'all man mm -hmm, for sure you know how little y'all gonna be in a matter of seconds like how small oh my god wow incredible but y'all are gonna pay man i found out so much shit bro and i've been doing that for the last couple weeks man like i've been doing it for the last couple weeks just learning y'all mechanics more because I was really interested in who y'all was. It's like it's like opening a power book series. You know what I'm saying? You know how you open like when you watch Power, you got you got what you got Kanan and you got like BM all those series. I opened power book series and learned y'all more. Ain't that crazy? I found out who y'all was and where y'all come from. 
that's because it was it was the it was kind of mind boggling to me that how y'all was so passionate about something that you don't make money out of like that. Like you make YouTube money, but your whole life is predicated on something that don't really exist. So it, like most of y'all, like I said, like the only person that I can say is was the person they was. I think either way, the only person that I could verify that for. Now I'm saying the only person, and this is not like, me just saying this, I'm saying the only one of y'all I think that was the same person without the camera, it was him, man. Yeah, because I think the only reason why you can't put him in the box, and you know what's so crazy about it? It makes you feel weaker as a king like myself, the biggest bird in this guy, because it's like, this is the only one that is like without sin with y'all to me. It's like me, like in the rap world, because I'm the only one of us that is who he is, for real, on my level, like for real. Because I'm the only one of us that's, when you you can check it out on him, right? Just me, out of the rappers and shit, like for real, from what I say, like, you know, that. But I saw his world before I saw y'all worlds. I saw it with my own two eyes. If I didn't see it, it'd be different. But I saw it, came lie on it. The, but the rest of y'all have been geek to chic transformation in this. Your whole existence was totally like, look, I tell y'all all the time, when I met Smack, I was a verb already. When I met Smack. Like, no, no, listen. When I met Smack, I was a verb already. You can go back and look on camera. I was exactly the, the person I was. Everything was familiar that y'all seeing now. Nothing has changed. That's why nothing really bothered me or nothing like that, right? Most of y'all wasn't. Because I remember who you was when I met you. I remember the human you was. That is the human you really is. Getting behind this camera has gave you a false sense of being a person. And a lot of you all I know are snakes, just not a bigger snake than me. So guess what snakes like me do? Uh, can I tell y'all a snake story? Yes. What a snake will do, like myself, when I notice the little hiss in you, since I'm a bigger snake, I, I, I get up there next to you and I pretend to understand you. Just to make sure to see what kind of snake you is. And then when I find out you don't have any fangs, oh, you just look like it. Yeah, but one of y'all bought some hair. We're going to go on YouTube today, I think. I, I got to get a time today. And the person that gets it right, we're, we're going to just burn him right then and there. And, and guess what? We'll call and verify it too. For real. Because what y'all bloggers don't know is the same way, like a lot of these rappers, like when I take rappers and shit, a lot of the people that know them, they always reach out to me and show me who they really are, for real. Most of them, I can, I can look at them and say, that's hate, that's a lie, that's not accurate. But when I find something that stick, I just put it in the fire. People do the bloggers like that too, because they see that y'all have recreated y'all lives based on a lie, based on being like behind the camera. So your whole existence of how you eat, like, just think about it. This is the part where the empire strikes all the way back, right? Because I told y'all last Wednesday, starting Monday, I'm tripping. Because y'all, I noticed, right? You think that you're people. I dirt, one of you bitches tried today. Raise your hand and show resistance. You think that you people. Some of y'all, I'm, I'm, I'm going to ignore because I already know that you ain't a, a factor or nothing like that. I already know it. Once it's like, when it's an easy kill, like when I know know who you are, I just let it go because it's like, it dies out if I don't say nothing to you. Though. So I know that. Like, this is the thing. The, the, the thing about being the biggest bird in the sky, everything dies if I ignore you. If I ignore you, everything about you dies. No matter what you say, how many times you say it. That's the thing. Like, if you really think about it, if I mention you, your lights come on. I'm, 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 I'm right now. All the the biggest bloggers, pay attention to my words. I'm mentioning you. Now you challenged each other. I watched y'all have blogger wars amongst each other. Who wants some smoke with me, eh? Huh? Who wants some smoke with me, eh? Huh? Who wants some smoke with me? I, I want smoke with you all. Y'all challenge each other, right? 
This is me sitting a big ass gun in front of y'all. Spin the bottle, nigga. Who up first? Who up first? Huh? Angry fan, raise your arm. You want to go first? Huh? You want to go first? Would you like that? Angry fan, look, you smart. Look, would you like to go first and defend your kind? Huh? You want to go first? Guess what you can't do, angry fan? You know that, you know, angry fan, if we was at, um, y'all know that dance when you kind of wiggle your arms like a wave, like the break, break dancers be doing? They be like, dun -dun, dun -dun, dun -dun. And they act like it's power. JC did it in the video before. You know, remember when JC did that little, that little, little rock dance, like it's something going through him, and you, and you had to go through your arms. You can't do that, angry fan. You can't do that. You want to go first, huh? You want to go first? Cause God don't like ugly. That's why bad shit be happening to you. And I found out who you are. That's why bad shit happened to you. See, in the in the universe, guys, karma is a real thing. I know y'all don't think of it, but the energy you give out is what you give back, right? The reason why so many people like hate me is because they clearly know I hate them and don't give a fuck. It just go the other way. See, they hate me. I use it more as I don't give a fuck about your existence, which makes the human hatred. I hate him. He's so perfect because he is. And I'm the biggest bird in the sky. Rappers. Any of you rappers want to raise y'all hand? We can throw y'all in as the sides, the gumbo, the the, the uh, fried potatoes and onions. I have no problem with that. But I said last Wednesday, I said, when I get back from Miami, starting Monday, I'm unleashing a new wrath upon y'all. That is documented. You probably can find it on Sandy Page. Sandy has all of them. You can find it. I made it all the way clear, right? Monday it starts. I was tripping this weekend. I, I waved it when I said on, on, on the um, spaces. I mean, on the FaceTime with Swamp. I said, do you know how much dick you hoes have had in you all mouth? Should I say it right here? Everybody stood back because they know how I play. And they know I know what y'all did last summer. Right. A total rebuild is about to happen. We're pulling the set up. The set is going to be in control of media soon. Okay. We're going to control things. I said we're going to do things the appropriate way. For me to put my people on and let them eat and take the money. Listen, everybody on the set, get your YouTube page started. We got some money to get out of it. Because niggas think it's a joke and niggas playing. So I'm putting cases on all you bitches. I'm sending y'all to hell, man. We finna take this. My These people that I'm finna give these positions don't even know what they're doing. Get you some money. If you're on the set, turn your channels on. We're, I'm going to interview with you. We're going to remove the filth because I know who a fucking freak out here. Mm -hmm. I know one of you niggas bought some head. We're going to make y'all play the game today, man. From a nigga, man. One of y'all bought some. This is why a lot of y'all don't be coming out in the real world, right? Because you don't function well in it. I've never seen the die hard like... When I see bloggers and they don't show up too much, right? It's already a red flag, right? Big red flag. Because it's like, if you're a fan of something, you go to it. That's like me being a Jay-Z fan. And Jay-Z performs three times a year. You think I'm not going to be at the concert? Why wouldn't I go out to the concert? Because I don't function well in real settings. Hmm. Who's a dork? Most of you. Hey, bloggers. Who want to go first? The biggest, most dangerous bird in the sky is waving his pistol. Who would like to go first, nigga? None will be spared. It's just, a, well, look, my spare box is very small, man. Because the thing about a Gemini, right, he's dangerous mentally. He has many, many aspects and, and, and like different rooms in his head. I have a little attic of mercy in my head. I have an attic of mercy. It's like very, very small. I got a couple people in the attic of mercy. That doesn't mean I won't have to burn them later. Just not now. But bloggers, the rappers, and look, my people here, we're going to take this culture all the way over. Because it's easy. Because I'm the biggest, most dangerous bird in the sky. I can say whatever the fuck I want to y'all. 
I can. I can make you feel less than a human. And I would do it in person. Like everybody here, everybody that saw me all weekend was like, damn, Verb is the exact same he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Verb is the exact same person he is. I said the exact same things in person that I said to everybody when they see me. Nigga, fuck you. What you mean? All right. You heard what I said, right? Fuck is you talking about? Don't nothing change. See, y'all beats change. Mine's don't. My, like, mine's never changes, man. Never. That's why I'm the biggest, most dangerous bird in the sky. Because I can look you in your face and say, fuck you, and stand on that. Like, if I'm not cool with you, I'm not going to speak to you. I am going to step on you. And what y'all don't know, in this position, I can stop y'all from getting so much money. Because all I got to do is talk about you. Something that I'll do anyway. I can stop you. Y'all don't know a lot of y'all. Uh, I got a confession, Raider. Raider, is this a good time to confess? Or should I hold that though? At least one. You can confess at least one. All right. Okay, well, all right. I'll be stepping on a lot of y'all money. For real, I do. Like, a couple of you rappers that can't just seem to get booked, that's me, man. I really do be stepping on y'all shit. I do. I ain't gonna hold you. Because, look, what y'all don't know is it's a behind the scenes to every higher power. And when you're a higher power, you can get closer. I stepped on a few of y'all from getting some money. I do, for sure. I do. And, and it's always a simple phrase. If you use him, I won't even mention it or I will never fuck with it again. And guess what happens? You go out the window. And I can do that anywhere. Do y'all think I didn't do that in URL a couple times? Y'all think I can't do that everywhere? Sure. Yeah, sure. Because look, I'm gonna tell y'all something. Even with low leagues, right? Here, even with low leagues, if you get booked for a little job, hey, for real. Matter of fact, attention leagues, attention small leagues coming up, right? From now on, go through me to book book the rappers. Mm -hmm. I think y'all should go through me. Matter of fact, that's what's gonna happen to to ensure that you get keep your money, right? Okay, this is what I'll do for y'all, right? Uh, for all upcoming leagues that is booking bigger name guys, if you book anybody that's been on the URL stage or any professional stage, you should broker the deal with me because I can guarantee the one that's going to show up and not. A lot of y'all get y'all money taken from these guys because they're in rough situations. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. We're going to let the cat out the bag, right? Okay. A lot of these guys that take y'all money, small leagues, they're taking it because they need the money for that moment. They have no intention of coming to rap. I'm telling y'all, this is 100% accurate. Now, sometimes you have ones that, that, that stand on it and come do it, right? I know the ones that will do it. If you want to be insured, this is all leagues for a small fee. I will make sure the artist that you booked will, have, will get on stage for you because I know his bitch ass secrets. And if he play with you, we burn him. What's up? That way you save your money. The smaller leagues can't really get on their feet when y'all take their money because they're trying to get in position to make money, to make other opportunities come. When y'all take their money and stop, it ruins everything. Attention, small leagues. Don't you book a motherfucking artist here that comes from the URL stage because y'all don't know the mechanics or if they're coming. I do. I do. And then the problem is, if you play with this league, if this league then came to me and said, Verb, can you ensure this? You give me my feet, nigga, you can't play with me on no aspect. And you know that. You got to go do that. Because I know things too, and we're going to be tripping, right? Let's save the leagues. We're going to save the leagues here, but we're going to remove the filth. Now, bloggers, who wants to stick their fucking chest out? Hmm? Because y'all are sick, fucking unnoticed humans on the planet. Most of you, right? You've, you've created your whole everything based off people's lives. I mean, based off people, other people's lives. Not based off your own. No. You found a way to say, I'm going to do this. Say anything, right? Get my clicks from it and I can feed my people. 
That's fine. The drought is about to start. I am the exact same person I am here that I am everywhere. And everybody kept telling me that. Even on stage, Swamp, while he was rapping, Swamp said, man, why are you talking when I'm rapping? I was telling my boy to get out, to step back. He was standing on my foot. So I was like, hey, get back a little bit, right? I said, nigga, I can say what I want to say over there. That was my exact word. In a room full of his people. I said that myself. Nigga, I can say whatever the fuck I wanted to say. That's on, I don't change my beat, y'all. And that's why when y'all come to my city and, and y'all got to deal with me or something like that, they're going to tell you, dude, this is exactly who the fuck you said here. The power is real. Now I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to show y'all because now the set is going to get their money. I think we're going to, because St. Louis has all the power, right? I think we're going to, hey, Temp, I think it's time that you come up a little more. I think it's time that you get your rifle seat a little more. Yeah, I think it's time. I think, don't worry about it. We're going to make some room because we're going to take out a few of these niggas. We're going we're gonna to take out a few of them for sure. Don't worry about it. With this storm that's about to come, let's just say if it's six of them, only two going to survive it, man. Only two will survive it, I'm sure. Everybody get your cameras, man. Because I'm, I'm going to set this time up because it's either we're going to start on Angry Fan and work him for real, like traumatize him for real, Angry Fan. I think we could traumatize you first and make a make an example out of you for real. You know you unmatched, right? You know you unmatched, right? But we're going to start with you. I want it with you first, though. Matter of fact, you know what? Spin the bottle, nigga. I take two of you a day. Who will? Who will? What's up? Because I found out who y'all was, and I told y'all this was gonna start Monday. I told y'all this last week, right? last Wednesday. Document it. Now, who's my friend? I asked Shuni. Shuni's my friend. Shuni's my friend. I asked Shuni out of town. I saw Shuni at the. Uh... I'm gonna give y'all some behind the scenes on that shit too. Uh, I saw Shuni at the face off. Shuni walked in. You know. And I said, hey, Shuni. She said, hi, Verb. I said, you my friend? She said, of course. Okay, I like Shuni. I like Shuni, and I like Zan. I think out of the girls. I like Shuni, Zan, Holly. Um, Let me see. Shuni, Zan. Hey, hey, Ray, dude, it's either my list is very short or I'm running out of fingers. What do you think it is? I, I, I can't tell. Like, I might be running out of fingers because... Like, clearly, it, the, the list is getting very thin from this moment out. It really is. But, I mean, I like a few. I like a few. But uh, a couple of them, too. Like, they, you know, the girls and shit, they don't really, they like kind of like, you know. Oh, I saw a lot of y'all favorite little blogger girls this week. Oh, man, a lot of these trash, though. I ain't going to even hold y'all, man. I ain't going to hold y'all. Like, I saw a lot of y'all, like, a lot of the girls that be like you see like in the culture, like they got the cool little pictures and shit like that. I saw a lot of them this week. Oh, them hoes is trash. A lot of them hoes is trash, bro. Like y'all don't know it and shit. But yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm tripping with y'all too, probably. For sure. I apologize. I apologize. No, I don't. No, no, no. Oh wait a minute. Hold on. Oh, oh, I ain't see that. Hey, I sent you the thing too, uh, Radio. My bad. I I ain't know y'all was there. I ain't have it in my hand. But yeah, I hey listen, this weekend, like a lot of the, the female fan girls that be in their pictures and, and you think they little pictures is all right, a lot of you was weak. Mm -hmm. I saw a couple of y'all shoes leaning too. That was unacceptable. For sure. Like for real. Like the day I went to the, the battle uh Ross thing, let me give you, I'm gonna give y'all some behind the scenes about the whole weekend. So when I went to the uh I had went to the the uh the the Easy and Charlie night though, which I thought was dope too. I, I like that. So when I went to the Easy and Charlie night, it the 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 crowds was totally different from Friday and Saturday. Two different worlds. Easy and Charlie night, I seen more more of like the 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 fans that were. I saw fans that were what you call them like, you know you know the fans that we be having and be popping up and shit. Yeah, like I saw a lot of them and I saw a lot of them rappers. Hey, look. A lot of the female rapper's shoes was leaning bad, too, though. I'm not going to hold y'all. Like, that was another red flag for me, too. Like, I was like, hey, this is, hey, hey, Ray, do I walked in that bitch and shit with the Mexico jersey and shit, Cinco de Mayo, hat matching. 
I see as a bitch, real stuff around my neck. A lot of y'all, the shit that y'all put around y'all neck too, it causes a lot of delusion too. Like them, un, like them foreign metals. Like when I battled Swamp and how all of them was jumping around and acting like monkeys. Like I, I never seen it. They all had that titanium shit around their neck. That shit like vibranium. It, it's controlled by Swamp. He, he hits the S chain. And all of them moved a certain way. I don't know what the fuck that was. But I saw a lot of weird shit this weekend, though. Like, I saw some of the weirdest things with these people. And, it, like, me and Brody from the neighborhood, we just sitting out on the car. And we like, hey, man, these people dorks, ain't they? And we just thinking in our head, like, yeah, man. I saw a lot of weird behavior. So I saw my Shuni. Shuni's good with me. But the bloggers, like, angry fan. You little one-armed bandit. You will be first. I, I would like to get you out the way. You out the way. Hey, angry fan, how does it feel knowing that your one arm ass always look like you're spinning a record at a DJ table? How does that feel? How does that feel? When you, like when you see you, it look like you're, you know how you spin a record. D, any DJs in the house that scratch the records like, like that? Do y'all can't imagine that. Y'all know when a DJ does that? How his arm look? That's how you walk around, angry fan. How does that make you feel as a human? What that boy do, man? Oh, nothing. No, I'm tripping. And nobody did anything. I'm just trying. I told y'all last week, Brostein. I'm sure you've been here listening, right, nigga? I, I told y'all last Wednesday, starting Monday, I said, when I get back from Miami, I'm going to unleash a rage upon y'all because I found out who y'all were. And, and us as humans, we got to eliminate the filth. Okay? One, <laughs> yeah, man. Man. Yeah, we gotta we have to eliminate the filth. And today on YouTube, I'm gonna get a time and we're gonna guess which one of y'all niggas bought some hair from a nigga. Hey, what? Yes, I pro hey Rothstein, I wasn't even shocked. Cause when you buy something, it's it, you're demanding it. I, I need this. Like they didn't even like he didn't even do, didn't even like go mack him a nigga or no shit like that. That nigga said give it to me you know you know when you when you demand to spend your money it's imperative like skipping the line i don't want to talk that's what that means when you take your motherfucking money you feel absolutely that's just sound crazy don't it? say it again hey why your background so loud man we in the middle of church man what kind of freaky shit you got going on man what the fuck is it do i need to find out who the fuck ross thing what the fuck is going on man why is it always these? Uh, why, nah, why, why, why your background I'm in room, sound? I'm in, a, I'm in a room with a few, of, with a few of my people. Yeah, you know I mean, I'm in here being the example right now. Yeah, you know I mean, it's good though. This, uh, this all PG. You know what I mean? This all good right here. Yeah, I'm just saying, nigga, your background be changing a lot too, nigga. Like your background changes quite a bit. Yeah, like that. Yeah, real like, loud, like, like Batman or something. Like, yeah, you see how we in the same say. way? What I yeah. just say? What I say, nigga? What I just say? See, look, how I called you down, nigga. What you mean? You said, yeah, see what I'm saying? Nigga, I said it before you, motherfucker. I'm, I'm ahead. Look, man, I got y'all so under control. I knew your attack. Boom, there it is right here, man. <laughs> no. What's up, nigga? Right here. There it is. I, I'm right here with you. The fuck is he? He said, what? Yeah, what did I say? How did I say it before you? And it's your thought, nigga. Huh? But bloggers, I'm, I'm, who wants to go first? Y'all are fucking freaks. I found out, man. And I, I warned y'all last week. Exact quote. Hey, I'm sure Sandy will find it. Just make a little clip and I say, hey, next week, my rap, I'm going to, I said it multiple times too. I said, next week, I'm going to be tripping with y'all in a different way. Now, most of y'all say, okay, it's verb normally tripping with us every day, no matter what. Like I do that on a high clip regardless, because that's just who I am. It makes me feel good, right? Because I, I like it. Last night, Doc told me, that it was trauma. The reason why I like nothing phases me and I just like to do this type of shit to y'all. He said it was trauma. Wait a minute, hold on. Let me see. He said it was my traumas and shit. And I'm like, oh, okay. That's what it is, my trauma. Ma matter of fact, hey, hold on. Let's get a. Wait, 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 hold on. I, it's a couple of years. Wait a minute, hold on. Okay. Okay, my you think? All right, so. All right, hey, Tim. Hey, Tim. I, th I thought about something, right? I think it's time that you come to the front. What's the word, my boy? I think it's time you come to the front. I think it's we're gonna about to send some power to you. I think, I because I'm finna eliminate a couple of them this week, like for real. And I think that you will be a good representation. You know, how do you feel about the new job? I think I think that you can handle this because <laughs> look, here's the thing. It, it don't take much, right? 
All I gotta do is come interview with you a couple times, and there you go. You're off to the races, right? No, that's that's, that's, that's a fact. That's yeah, a that's fact. it. All I gotta do is come do exclusive shit with you a couple times. Just send or look, I can make it even easier. I can just tape myself and then just send it to you, man. That's it. I'll just tape me talking and talking about myself, right? Some good shit, right? And then guess what? You can just have you got this book. We're gonna call this the book of Venices in the book of verb, because this is my shit. The Venice book of what? Man. Venices. This is Venices. The next Venices. chapter, yeah, Venices. I'm gonna give <laughs> Venices to Temp, right? The next chapter will be Vexodus. Everything me, motherfucker, right? I'm gonna have books, just what my theories and my thoughts is, right? About y'all. And I'm gonna give them to people like Power Stones, motherfucker. I can talk for an hour, take me, give it to him. He has material for two weeks straight. You ain't lying. I appreciate yeah, you I appreciate damn right. these conversations. Hey, hey, listen, I'm hey, look, Tim, don't worry about it. I'm gonna get you a your own St. Louis pack. Don't worry about it, man. Don't listen. I know what to do to power up the people I need in power, right? And and we're gonna control the floor because I'm gonna eliminate these fields, though. We're gonna remove them. I'm challenging them. I'm not waiting to, for them to trigger me. I don't know what they say about me. I'm challenging them first, though. Because so I'm, why, I'm angry fan, them. why is Angry Fan the first one? <laughs> I, I I think I want to win him right now, though. First, this will be the easiest to to, to take off first. Loudest and the easiest for sure. So we'll just knock that out the way, and then I'll just start chipping out the blocks out the way. You feel me? Well, well, not the most. Well, well, I'm saying the attack that I have for him is easy for me, but his voice is loud. So when you step on this one first, the rest of them just fall. Like, click, 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 click. Because it's like, you know, it is what it is. But I'm going to take down a few people, though, this week. So I want to power this up, right? I want to power the people up, and we're going to up pistols on everybody. Cause y'all are punks, man. Like it's crazy. Like when you find out who these bloggers are. Like the other day when I saw you say you went to Anwar and said, you know, was y'all cool? It wasn't gonna be shit but cool. What? What's the other option? It ain't no other. <laughs> like what? What was gonna be the? Listen, bro. Listen here. Let me explain something to y'all. Touching or dealing with a disrespecting a cardinal cap is an act of automatic war. Cause I'm the war general here. Like, I be, yeah, I be trying I mean, to kill, man. I be trying to no, tell them. No, this, bro. I, I listen. It ain't nothing to say. It's just no. You, you, you play with anyone that wears that cap. It's an automatic act of war, man. Like automatic, automatic act of war. Automatic, man. That's just what that's gonna be. So you ain't gotta ask him. Is he cool? It ain't shit. Go. It, what's gonna happen? Nothing. Yeah, it's cool. Anything else you want to say? Treat yourself. Treat yourself. Ain't shit gonna happen. I'm taking these niggas down, man. I'm 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 really gonna one by one chip them niggas down to the floor. Because look, y'all twist the theories up, y'all take clips and, and name shit what you wanna name it, right? You do little things, right? And y'all controlled by other niggas, man. And Most they open the culture of nothing. Yeah, right, right. Look, I, but I'm I'm challenging nothing. them. Look, look. I'm telling them, this ain't on nobody else, y'all. Verb is standing outside with his pistol. I'm challenging y'all. Who would like to go first? Because you 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 take people clips, you chop them up, you create the narrative you want. You have the power to like sway people, thoughts and shit like that. But you not you don't have the credibility to do it, though. Y'all only talk behind a camera. Angry fan is still in 720. Nothing has changed. Nothing. I know who all y'all are now, man. And I, I warned y'all last week. It's not like something I just made up. Like, no, I told y'all last week. This was over me. I said, I'm going to be cruising the street, putting cases on all you bitches. If you my friend, just pretend like you are. Um, now, now, also, young niggas, I mean, professional rappers, I'm finna stop y'all money train with the up-and-coming leagues. Attention up-and-coming leagues, it makes no sense to book them. Why? When you take your money out the house, right, you're gambling on a nigga coming in the house. You're trying to make quick money. High probability he's not going to come. But if you book him through me, he will be there. You take your money 
and you're gonna book him, right? You see, I'm gonna control who gonna make the, the underground money. Because it makes sense. When you talk to an up and coming league, right, y'all, and they trying to grow, the league is trying to grow. I say, hey, attention league, check this out. You need to keep your money safe because you don't have that much money to be throwing out because you can end everything. I'll book him for you because I know he's going to come. And I'm also going to know which ones not to get no money. Don't give it to him. How many times he called you for it? Four times. No, he ain't going to ever be there. Don't, don't, no, don't send that. I'm stepping on y'all. I'm also going to step, step on y'all names behind the wall too, though. For sure. So y'all rappers can get mad, but we're going to cut, we cutting y'all one. Some of y'all will never get, look, man, listen, I'm going to tell y'all the truth, bro. Here's the truth, right? Y'all can y'all can be finna get the opportunity of your life in front of a big name rapper, right? If I call him, I bet you it slow down. I bet you that shit stop. Do you not believe that? You could think that you like a lot of y'all have been on the t like for real. Let me tell y'all the truth, right? A lot of y'all have been on the table for ice pack for ice pack battle. For real, a lot of y'all have for real. Uh, like, I'm not bullshitting y'all, man. It has been quite a few options for Ice Pack to battle, right? Where all he has to do is say, yeah, and y'all phone ring. Do you know how many of y'all niggas I've stepped on so far? Uh, I think the last one I stepped on, his name was like Riggs or something, right? I stopped him from getting Ice Pack money. I stopped him from getting Ice Pack money, for sure. Yeah, because that was going to be on the trenches. I stopped that. I did that. That was me. Hey, Riggs, I stopped your... You, you was finna get the call for the trenches. It was gonna be ice packing you. I just said, I, I, I just don't think that's a good idea. What happened with you and Riggs? Nothing. Like, really, nothing. I just didn't need a... I don't need a reason to stop it either, though. Chef Trez, you too was also about to get some ice pack money. I stopped it too. Sorry. But that was like a month and a half ago. I'm sorry. 